welcome Jim Grant. He is founder and editor of Grant's Interest Rate Observer. Jim, welcome. It's great to see you again. All right, thank you, Kelly. Nice to be here. I, I, I was feeling in an unfortunate way, like the world at least is probably starting to make a little more sense to you than it did the past couple of years. Yes, well, Kelly, this is Interest Rate Liberation Day. Uh, the uh, Japanese peg on its uh, 10 year yield, 25 basis points, appears to have been broken or is breaking. And the Swiss, as Rick just observed, have, uh, have moved away a little bit from deep zero to slightly more than, or less than <laughs> deep zero. So, let me, my uh, take on this is that uh, uh, this is fundamentally to the good interest rates being the most con the consequential prices in capitalism. They ought to be. Uh, market determined, and we have been living certainly since the Great Recession of so long ago, uh, with market uh, not determination, but uh, uh, prices being administered largely by by central banks. These important prices being administered by the central banks, and it has given us, um, you know, lovely bull markets, but also I think a wholesale misallocation of resources, of time, and the brain power. Um, it's given us, uh, you know, we had a great crypto delusion. It's given us uh, it, the immensity of private equity, highly leveraged, uh, public venture experiments, and on and on and on. So I think that we are leaving the wall of mirrors and that interest rates, uh, if to the extent they will be determined in the marketplace, will be the guide for the future. And that's a good thing.